Hi everyone, it's Celeste. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have quite a special video for you guys. I know that I say that about almost every one of my videos, but this one's especially special, as you can tell by the art that I'm showing you at the moment. And for those of you who've been following me for quite a bit will know that I've done all of these drawings in the past and these digital paintings in past videos, but today I wanted to follow a little bit of a trend started by someone named Derek D'Souza. He's a really amazing artist on Instagram. I suggest you go check him out if you're curious. His link will be in the description box. But yeah, he created this trend where you essentially make a wall of all your artwork that you've made in the past year and you draw yourself kind of just observing it all and taking it all in. And I thought this was a really cool trend especially for me since I don't really get to reflect on a lot of my work or really appreciate it for what it is. But I really enjoyed making all of this art for you guys. And without further ado, we're going to get into our project. So here I'm starting off with a gouache wall and arranging all of my artwork to where I wanted it to be on the page. Uh, it was a little difficult trying to format it all the way I wanted, but we finally got a good fit for it all. And now I'm just kind of going in the background with shading and um, making it look like they're actual canvases on a wall. Now I'm actually drawing myself and as I said I am looking at the art that I have made so you guys are looking at my backside but that is all good. <laughs> um, yeah so I just started sketching my hair or painting in my hair with the highlights and such and I always love doing hair. That's like one of my favorite parts of any drawing, as you guys might know. So yeah, just highlighting, highlighting the hair and then going in with a finer detail um, brush. I think it was, yeah, the fine hair tool. And I'm just going in to my ends, the ends of my hair with that tool to make it look a little bit more realistic. And now I'm going in with, again, the fine hair tool on the left and right sides of my head for some flyaways. And then I'm going to begin working on the sweater. Now this sweater is an actual one that I have and I usually wear it in combination with a reddish, like a reddish orange skirt. And my close friends will know this. Uh, maybe a lot of people at my school will know this combination, but I do wear it and I think it's really cute. So if you look closely, you can see that I'm making little fuzzies on the sweater to kind of create more of that sweater-like effect. Again, apologies for not being able to zoom in too close. Unfortunately, the way it saved, like this was as far as I could zoom. And now I'm going to start working on my iPad. I drew a little Apple Pencil in this sort of keyboard case that I have and it really looks like this. I tried to make it look as real as possible. Um, I added some glare on the screen of the iPad and yeah, and now we're kind of coming close to the end um, where I'm trying to add some light. I was experimenting back and forth with what light looked good where, and I ended up going with this one. I thought it looked really cool. And then I added a little bit of sunshine on my hair, and that is pretty much it. <laughs> this was a very fast video. I know it's been a while since I've done any art of any kind, but I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I enjoyed making it. It was loads of fun to kind of just look back and reflect on all the work that I've done and all the proud work I've done for you guys. Um, I wouldn't have been able to make all this work without all of you being here for me. I want to keep making more content for you guys, so if you'd like, leave a like. <laughs> and if you're new, please subscribe and share with a friend or two if you think they might find this sort of thing interesting. So with that, my friends, I will end this video. Be kind to one another, stay safe, and I will see you in my next video. Toodaloo, take care, I love you. Mwah.